And I would like to invite all of our young worshipers forward as we take a seat. Come on up and let's gather on the steps here. So if you didn't know this about me, I love my car very much. It's a very precious thing to me. <laughs> Some of you know this about me. I'm very, very careful about keeping it clean and waxed, and I put so much time to it, and I care, care about it so much. It is like one of my children, which sounds quite silly, doesn't it? Yes? But again, if some of you know me, you, you know this about me. So I have something special for you today. What do they look like, Asher? Keys. Yes, these are my keys to my car. And guess what? I'm going to give it to somebody. Is it right? I don't know, who am I feeling about giving my car keys to somebody? This is a very, this is very terrifying to me, right? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> us too, yeah. <laughs> I think I'm gonna give you the keys. So, <laughs> don't worry, Asher, you'll get something, I promise. <laughs> don't worry, Asher, we're, we're getting back to this. So, I gave you my keys to my car. Do you know how to drive? No, right? Do you know? about road rules or laws or anything, stuff, right? Your parents drive you around, right? You know that like you see a red light, you stop. You see a green light, you go. But what happens if somebody gets into a situation where you need to all of a sudden change direction and, it, right? You, you haven't had a lot of practice driving, right? Okay, so maybe give my keys back. <laughs> okay, how about I give my keys to you? Now, do you know how to drive? Okay, give me my keys back. <laughs> Asher, do you know how to drive? You do? <laughs> well, then here you go, my friend. The keys are all yours. <laughs> the point is, right, I'm giving you something that's very precious to me that I care a lot about. Now, it's a silly car, right? It's just a material object, yes. But if you, if you were listening to our gospel message, you heard that Jesus gave the keys to the kingdom to who? Did you? A disciple, yes, Peter, our disciple, way to go. Now, do you think Peter knew what Jesus was talking about by here are the keys of the kingdom? No, no it's kind of a weird phrase, right? And, and, and yes, we're using this, this image of me giving you my car keys in the same way that maybe Jesus wasn't saying literally here is a key to the kingdom, go ahead and enter in, right? But here's what I do think about this story. This is what I'm gathering from this. How do we know that Peter knew what he was doing? Asher, okay, go ahead. He was cutting off someone's ear. <laughs> wow, you're getting ahead of the story. Way to go. Not quite, but here, I'm gonna take my keys back for just a second. Okay, let me, let me back up a little bit. Okay, so we did, we're, we're going to assume that Peter didn't know what was going on and that he didn't know that Jesus was entrusting this big commission to carry on the church way past Jesus dying, way into the world. Even to this day, we are built on the church that Peter carried into the world, right? So here's what I'm going to... We are not just giving keys away recklessly, right? We give keys knowing that we are going to learn how to drive. So we go to traffic school and we learn all the laws and the rules of driving. We learn how to be good, compassionate people on the road, right? Passive drivers, that means we, we yield to people, we give way to people, we try to be friendly to them, we try to communicate as best we can. How is this different from the church, right? What did you do when you were this age? You went to Sunday school. What happened after Sunday school? Confirmation. Here we go. Okay. Com you're going to learn all about it one day, Asher, I promise. But the idea here is that we are learning how to do these things together. And the best part about it is that we all get the opportunity. Jesus chooses every single one of us and gives us the keys to the kingdom. But... Here's the one thing. I believe God also trusts us to learn 
what that means and how to be in community with each other, how to be in relationship with each other, how to learn the stories of the Bible, all these things about how to be better people in this world and to share the love of God. Sound good? All right, will you pray with me? I'm going to take my keys back again. I'm sorry. It makes me very nervous. Come on, Freya, you can do it. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's find our feet on the floor. Will you give your toes a little wiggle for me? Give the toes a little wiggle. If you are comfortable, let's close our eyes. Put your prayers up in like a receiving gesture, right? Your palms are facing up towards the sky. And we're going to take a deep breath in. Oh. Gracious God, thank you for trusting us with your keys to the kingdom. May we use it wisely. May we fill our minds with wisdom, and may we learn all the ways that we can love each other and ourselves and Jesus. And we say amen. Thank you for joining me. Have a good rest. Oh, no, you're going off to Sunday school. I remembered. Yeah. Have fun. See you back in a little bit. <laughs>